This guy's a freaking idiot. He literally just left his tractor sitting there in gear with no brake set and the wheel's still friggin' turning. Wow. I've seen some crazy stuff in my time, but dang. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> he must have got the ho forklift hooked up finally. I'm ready to be unloaded. I'm next in line. I don't know what this guy's doing. But he's not a flatbed, so it doesn't matter. Right now, I'm dealing at 82 degrees. I have no tolerance to heat whatsoever. <laughs> I have been sitting here for about an hour. Well, the truck's been sitting here. I've been working for about an hour. I have about four hours and 50 minutes left to drive today. Six hours, 13 minutes on my 14 hour clock, which isn't gonna last long at this rate. I have no idea where I'm gonna head from here. I'm on I-45, so probably either Houston or Conroe. There's a tenorous pipe in Conroe, so that's down here somewhere. I can't remember where. Or someplace in Houston, whatever. <laughs> at this point, it doesn't really matter. He's so pissed You have zero hours and five minutes of remaining drive time. So I do. That's fine. Because I am stopped for the night. I got this little rest area on I-45 and this thing's freaking out because uh, I didn't take the turn it wanted me to take right here. So it wants me to go all the way back up I-45 and back down I-45 and turn around and come back up I-45 to go through that turn again. That's not going to happen. We are just going to skip it completely. Jesus. And go from 94 miles to 81 miles. And we'll call that good. And there's a friggin' fly hanging around in my truck somewhere. There he is. He needs to get out. You need to get out of my truck. Out. Out, I say. I said, get out. A little, you're sad. You just don't listen, do you? I'm gonna get you out. Ow. <laughs> My seat farted. Get out! <laughs> anyway, I got that little lumber off. No problem. Went over to Owens Corning in Houston. Picked up this load. It's going to Irving. I'm basically repeating what I did this uh, this Monday, and my X strap is like totally not even, not even, freaking there. <laughs> yeah, right. This place smells like coffee because somebody dumped theirs all over the place, <laughs> and I don't like that very much. I don't like the smell of coffee all that much. But anyway, I'm here. I'm gonna go 81 miles in the morning and it's gonna be great. I mean, that's pretty much it, really. That's pretty much it. 